Keep fighting voices in my mind that say I'm not enough Every single lie that tells me I will never measure up Just the sum of every high and every low Remind me once again just who I am What's up other reefers? You know it's me back out here again NVO John 13 Talking about some other things we're gonna do to the tank if you could see, there's some salt falling the side. There's some algae on the back. It's kind of dirty on the side of the tank too. So we gonna we're gonna clean it up. Today we're gonna discuss and show and teach how to clean a salt water tank. The proper way the power heads everything in here everything how to clean it and we're gonna change the water too got some water there bought me um, a filter a little sock filter I'm gonna add it up with some carbon black diamonds yes sir so we're gonna start with that first and I show you everything you're gonna need okay so you continue on that side let me see oh look I had some over here oh yeah that's one there alright just on all the way in the back You can see right here. You right here in the back. Hands in there. We go. I really didn't want to take this out, but you know, you should do the proper cleaning. I really don't like putting my hands in here neither. I had to think the a longer one of these, but I couldn't find it, but oh well. Just scrape all the back. Y'all this fish just attacked me. I should have seen that. I was crazy. I was like, okay now you do the other side. Do the other side. Put it right there for y'all to see. This thing is really complicated. Yo. Don't need that. Bro, y'all seen that? Yo, he just attacked me. What is you doing, son? What is you doing? You my boy, you here attacking me? I'm gonna feed you for that. Chill out. I'm trying to clean your tank. You like your tank to be dirty? Oh, 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 oh. Hey, move. Move. Y'all see how he's trying to attack? Watch, I'm gonna let him attack for y'all to see. Go, attack me. Ah, you don't wanna attack me, huh? You think you're a big boy? I see that though, right? Move the 
Uh, uh, Before you get your hands in here, make sure make sure your hands are clean, boy. Rinse them with warm water about an hour to 30 minutes before you get your hands in here. Do not use any soap, detergent, nothing. I don't think I'll use any detergent to wash your hands, but. You gotta be careful when you're not doing this. You gotta move everything out the way. All right. So, so that's all with the cleaning. Y'all see it's going to be a little bit foggy. I see it's kind of foggy and dirty because the water came down. I'm about to wipe that down, get a towel. Y'all can use the same towel y'all were using to, to clean your hands, so get it. Always got to make sure your surface is clean. If y'all want me to get a new tank, I'm trying to get a 60 nano reef tank all in one for my just for my clownfish and my anemone. And I'm gonna try to add some bigger fishes in here. All this set salt in the side. It's over. It's one thing I don't like about this. If any of y'all could help me out and tell me how can I keep all this salt from coming out, dude, that would be wonderful, man.
things back around. Give it a nice edge. We'll try to get it clean as possible all the way around. It's kind of foggy because, you know, there's basically dirt running around. Well, not dirt, just. And we still ain't close to done with the cleaning. Close to done. Close this up really quick. On the top. All right, cool. Now, open it. I'm gonna use the toothbrush. I'm gonna use the toothbrush that I cannot find. Dylan, have you seen the toothbrush? I yes, I have seen it. Where is it? I know. Did you see it, but you don't know. Here. Hi guys. Today we do fish and we're doing this. This is the camera. Um we spend day and put it inside the box. No, I'm just trying to see. Okay. Yes, okay. So I got the toothbrush. Toothbrush I use to clean. So with this, you're gonna get the power head. <coughs> Try to get in there. Power head. And there, guys. And there, okay? See you right over here, okay, guys? Yeah, I can't see because I'm just chalking with you. Is it in there? In there? Right, you see, he's doing right. Because you have to see what he's doing in there. In there, yeah. Remember, remember, to clean your tank. tomorrow clean your tank, right? So this is everything you're going to need to start. Make sure you have a towel. If you don't got one of these, it's to scrape the back, the front. You should go try and buy one out. I really do not like the plastic. I feel like the little razor blade gets out more of the corners, gets out everything. So I'm going to go with this. Um, let me see what else I'm gonna need, and you're gonna need a toothbrush. So, you're gonna need a toothbrush that I really don't know where to put it. 
I don't know where to put it at, but yeah, you're gonna need a toothbrush. I'm gonna find that out. So let's start with scraping everything. Take out your watch out, I'm not trying to damage it, even though it's waterproof. So just start scraping it up. You don't wanna do what I just did. Spill water. Don't do that. What I'm gonna do right now? For I'm to be spilling water. See, this is what you need a towel for. This is what you need a towel for. What I'm gonna do, I'm gonna turn off the Where the water stops flowing and clean this up quick. Don't want the wife coming home and be like, What's up with all this water in the floor? What won't you do? We got time for What's up, baby? It's okay, she's, she's fine. Just let her watch your curtains. She's not crying, she's just happy. So you scrape all the way down. Great. All the Daddy, can I see? Okay, so go. I'm guessing when you make a video and your kids find out, they're gonna always interrupt you. Okay. You're going to try to leave this tank as beautiful as possible. Make sure I don't hurt the snare. Okay, we'll clean the rest. We'll move some of my corals to the top. Okay, the rocks on your way. Well, let me move my coral first. This is gonna not float. I think that was gonna float. This one, this core right here, my my clownfish stressed it out way too much. So it's on the process of, of coming back to life. All right, so you need that rock. Take this out. You're gonna have some trash floating around. More that the power, the the pump is not on to suck it. So. It's gonna look dirty at first, but no worries. No worries, guys. This rock, I'm definitely not gonna move. Okay. A little snow right here. He just found a button like two days ago. Alright. So, 
let's do get the towel in this hand, some switching hands. Gotta do it as gentle, but put force on it, but not force that you're gonna scrape it. And I know when there's different type of things, you gotta do something else to clean with it. Okay, so I'll do it down. You just know you gotta be doing water changes about twice a week, depending how you feed your corals. I mean, if, um, depending how much food you put in here. You feed your fish, with your corals. Hey, you wanna see how I fed my corals? I think I got a video of it. So, y'all should go look at that. Try to get as slow as possible. It's gonna be a little hard because it works, but that ain't no problem. Whoa, get this a little. Oh, kids. Kids are something else. We got another little smell right there. That's cool, dude. Now you gotta try to go oh god much more closer Okay so you continue on that side let me see let me see oh look I had some over here there is oh yeah that's one there alright just on all the way in the back All right, you can see right here. You right here in the back. Hands in there. Look over. I really didn't want to take this out, but you know, you should do the proper cleaning. I really don't like putting my hands in here neither. I don't think the a long one of these, but I'm gonna find it, but oh well. Just scrape all the back. Y'all this fish just attacked me. I should have seen that. I was crazy. I was like, okay now you do the other side. Do the other side. Put it right there for y'all to see. This thing's really complicated. Yo. Don't need that. Oh, y'all seen that? Yo, he just attacked me. What is you doing, son? What is you doing? You my boy, you here attacking me? I'm gonna feed you for that. Chill out. I'm trying to clean your tank. You like your tank to be dirty? Oh, 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 no. Hey, move. Move. Y'all see how he's trying to attack? I'm gonna let him attack so y'all can see. Go, attack me. Nah, you don't wanna attack me. I know you think you're a big boy. I see that though, right? Move this up. This up.
before you get your hands in here, make sure Make sure your hands are clean, boy. Rinse them with warm water about an hour to 30 minutes before you get your hands in here. Do not use any soap, detergent, nothing. Even though I don't think you'll use any detergent to wash your hands, boy. You gotta be careful when you're not doing this. You gotta move everything out the way. All right. So So that's all with the cleaning. Y'all see it's going to be a little bit foggy. I see it's kind of foggy and dirty because the water came down. I'm about to wipe that down, get a towel. Y'all can use the same towel y'all were using to, to clean your hands so good. Always got to make sure your surface is clean. If y'all want me to get a new tank, I'm trying to get a 60 nano reef tank all in one for my just for my clownfish and my anemone. And I'm gonna try to add some bigger fishes in here. All this set the salt in the side. Put this over. Something thing I don't like about this. If any of y'all could help me out and tell me how can I keep all this salt from coming out, dude, that would be wonderful, man. Yeah. 
things going on. Give it a nice edge. Oh, try to get it clean as possible all the way around it's kind of foggy because you know there's basically dirt running around they're well, not dirt just and we still not even close to done with the cleaning close to done close this up really quick on the top All right, cool. Now, open it. I'm gonna use the toothbrush. I'm gonna use the toothbrush that I cannot find. You know, have you seen the toothbrush? I yes, I have seen it. Where is it? Did you see it, but you don't know. Here. Hi guys. Today we do fish and we're doing this. This is the camera. Um we spend day and put it inside the box. No, I'm just trying to see. Okay. Yes, okay. So I got the toothbrush. Toothbrush I use to clean. So with this, you're gonna get the power head. <coughs> Try to get in there. Power head. In there, guys. Okay. In there, okay? See you right over here, okay, guys? Then I can't see because I'm just chalking with you. Is it in there? In there? Right, you see, he's doing right. Because you have to see what he's doing in there. In there, yeah. Remember, remember to clean your tank. Tomorrow's clean your tank, right? You get the water, open the lid. If you got lid, don't have a lid, don't need to open on it. Let's fill it up. Right there. 
ranked a little mess, but it's okay. Now let's turn on the return pump. Just turn on the return pump. Feed the water. Let me clean the tank. Spilled. It's okay to spill water, just clean it quick. Yeah. So hopefully, it don't fill up too much. Let's just wait and see. Yep, so that's perfect limit, we could say. That's good. <laughs> My daughter over there crying like crazy, she needs me. So I'm about to end this video. Shouldn't go more up, it should be there. So yeah. Thank you guys for watching this video about how to clean your salt water tank proper way. And yeah. More videos will be coming up soon. Y'all just let me know what kind of videos y'all want to see. And y'all will have it. Shout out to Wade from What's In Your Tank. Best fish. Good O2, RO2 water. He sold me these clowns. And the, the yellow, yellow tang. He sold me the, the hammer. What else did he sell me? I think there's always two. Yep. Yeah. Cool people. I'm going to tag him in. So you can find his YouTube channel. I'm going to tag him. Everybody. Everybody already know what we got to do. Like and subscribe. And on to the next video. Take care and God bless to everyone in the world. Temple, Florida. We out here. I'm going to put in the description where's um, Wade's shop. You got a good shop. It's called What's In Your Tank. And the description, the naming, everything, the direction. So y'all could go and check them out. Take care, guys. Deuce.